I'm Leah Carey. And I'm Claire Carey. And we're here at our classes at Home Culture. And this was part of the Well-Rounded Dance Series. And we worked on Shadow Walls, which by the way, originally was called Marsupien. Uh -huh. So we started off with getting into shadow. We're gonna cover this really quickly. Mm -hmm. Started so, from backing walls. So a uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Then I'm gonna do something called a pendulum, a forward step, step back. Forward step, step, back, step, step. Then I'm gonna do a forward send my follow away. Release the dust. Forward, right to right, and back, up and over, right foot. In this case, leads are gonna do a foot fudge so that they're on the same feet that the follows are on. You have to do cool moves because of that. That's right. And so I'm gonna start with my left foot. My footwork is one, two, three, four, five, and step one. If you want to hold longer, you could do a one, two, three, four, and then, and then step, right? So if we're going one, two, three, four, stand there, right, right foot. foot. That so is legal. That's right, and the follows will not know it or feel it, but you do need to step back. Watch it one more time, looks like this. Yeah. Forward step, step, four, five, right and foot. one. Then we worked going in and out of the circle. So That's go, our basic. We go forward toward this way. We don't just need to go straight on. We can shade a little. And notice that actually shading our bodies. We're really not crossing. And then we can add a variation. On that variation, it looks like the follow is moving back and forth, and they are a little bit. But for the most part, we're going to be moving back and forth behind them. So starting with our partner on our right hand side, we allow our follow to get in front and we dance to the outside of our follow's feet. But notice I don't have to haul butt everywhere. I'm just hanging out, taking the lead. She's making it convenient for me. And then when she's ready, she's gonna snuggle back into that lovely shawl connection on my back. Then we also did some hesitations. Mm -hmm. On these, we played a little bit with the concept of compression, release, compression, release, where we're meeting our partner's hands. And, and we do that as we go down. Compression, release, shock. Compression, release, compression, uh, compression. Uh, and we can even go compression and go back line of dance and then go back into our basic and compression, compression. That's a one, two, three, four, rise up and come out. It's a nice way to go nowhere with style uh, or if that music has that really like, yeah. ah, da, those lovely downbeats, it can feel really powerful to run and then stop with those hesitations. Absolutely, we do have to slow down for them though. That helps. All right, then we had a nice simple little outside turn for the follow. This does have a little tiny prep. A prep is where you send the follow one direction to go the other way. It's usually a fairly tight, relatively quick motion. Mm -hmm. So in this case, the prep is one. one. And we're just rotating the partnership in to the, to the left. And then leads are gonna rotate the frame that way and then lift the hand. I'm gonna go two and then I'm gonna relax into it three with some running room. And a basic on top looks like this. Uh, one, two, three, here's the wrap. One, two, three, four, five, oh, six, a one, two, three, four, prep. And we one, two, three, four, five, six. Mm -hmm. All right, so next thing up. We want to make sure on this. Now, there is a double turn that is possible. We didn't spend a lot of time with it, but that does have a pulse, so just in case you're tempted. Mm -hmm. Three, four, same it'll be one, two, three, four, five, five and one. Just a little pulse, but it is no no big stirring. stirring. Yeah. All right. Then we had two variations that were very similar around the girls and through the rabbit hole, and I think we'll face the camera yeah. for that. So, a couple things to know. Actually, mm -hmm. I'm just going to say this. Um, imagine your superhero, your cape is a little dusty, shake it out, lift it up over your right side, and then, okay, I, I place it on my back, and I can bring it back down. That is the motion that we're gonna be doing as we're doing this variation. Mm -hmm. So, 
We're gonna bring our follow in front lift. I'm gonna take a pass here and then to the side. So it looks like this. One, two, three, four, five, six. Notice my follow is only off to my right. I have a little pressure in, the, in my left and in my right. I'm gonna step to the right. A one, two, three. Now I've got this lovely lower mm. left hand connection. She's pulling against it a little bit, the right, but not as much. And I'm gonna flip it, her up and over as I step to the left. A left, two, three. Looks like this. And basic, in front lift, and no one, two, three, four, five, six, so what? Two, three, four, five, and one. We really talked about how important it was for leads to step right, step, step, left, step, step, because that means I don't have so far to go, and I appreciate that. That's right. So, Here, one more time, going this way. Oh, yeah. one, two, three, four, five, six, to the right, to the left, and I get that level of no. left. <laughs> All right, then we have through the rabbit hole. Mm. I love this one. This one is so fun. This work makes it makes a pendulum motion as well, where I'm going to send my follow into a rose on the Titanic moment. And uh, one, two, three, for the rabbit hole. Step right, off her left, off her right. Okay. So the hand, from this the hand thing is is tricky and quick. So one two, three, four, let go of the left, offer it, and offer the right. Make sure you watch your follow turning, that makes sure that you don't smack them over the head on either one, one of them. One more time, let's go that way. You wanna go that way? All right, let's go that way. Face on top. Here we go, one, two, three, four, through the rabbit hole, forward, and back, offer, offer, and so, and it does not help to wiggle with fingers in a dark room. Then we had the swing out, and I think that's the last one. We had two variations we had, of the we swing We actually out. also had the Leeds uh, hammer lock. Oh, we did, which we, we did not review, and I don't think I put on the syllabus. <laughs> so we should probably do that. And one, two, Same three, entrance. four, five, she six. She hammer locks herself, one, and two, we can three, run together. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, and down, up, and over, four, five, six, so one. Two, three, four, one and one, two, three, four, hammer lock. We can run for as long as we want here, three, but then we'll four, start on one. And a one, two, oh, the three, four, four, and a one. That was like a pivot loop, which meant that she wanted to lead me in front of her first, and then, then up, up and, and over. over, so she doesn't want to lead me over here. And when we do it that way, then I get to keep my arm forward of shoulder and in its socket where it belongs, which I Down, so appreciate. Down, over, and over the head. Yeah. All right, then the swing out. Then the swing out. We added a new variation this time. On a yeah. swing out, we want to keep a bend in our elbows yes. so we have a nice little bounce there. And I'm going to send my follow out. Ah, shocking, it's a pendulum. Forward and back, yep. And do uh, what? Two, three, back, five, six, oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, oh, one, two, three, four. We talked about how leads are going to encourage their follows to keep going and follows. I'm going to fill that space and rotate into my arm. We talked about uh, having those nice big puffy elbows or flex, right? So I don't get all caught up. That would look like this. My frame collapses. No, instead I want to stay nice and big. And da, 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 yeah. That way I'm really mobile and right. Leads, you can adapt your follow. If they extend a little too much, you can keep your elbow a little tighter. That will help. Then we added, we made this into a sandwich. Mm -hmm. We That's added some a little stuff in between. Peanut, peanut butter jelly in the middle. <laughs> Actually, a tuck, it looks like this. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, and away. And back. And one, two, three, four, seven away, two, a tuck, tuck. I keep around. going, I rotate, ah, and so one, that lovely and bounce. Notice she's rotating on the first one, coming out on the tuck, and around rotating again. So she's not stopping that rotation. She's really not facing me at any point in time. She's rotated away from me. Yeah, we talked about the fact here. Let's do it this way. Um, uh, we talked about the fact that leads, you're really trying to get them to step on the downbeat, so that looks like this. One, two, step, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, up and over, 
wow. Follows, I want to be ready by my threes and my sixes, so I'm ready to go for ones and fours. And I do believe. I think that, that was, was a lot. That's that was awesome. Anyway, ready to go.